Hello everyone and welcome back to Ignite Gaming. This is part 15 of God of War gameplay series for PC version. In the last part we uh, explored uh, Thier's vault and we obtained the black rune and uh, we are all set to explore or head over to uh, Jotunheim and we would be heading over to the bridge that takes us to Jotunheim tower. And let's continue this story. There wasn't much compact involved in the last part, like it was more of a puzzle solving, uh, it was based on uh, God of War from the Norse mythology uh, here, his defenses that we were taking down, which he made like about thousand years ago maybe, so not much fighting to uh, be expected except the boss fight or the mini boss that we had at the end of the vault those two giants yeah that was one like that he's running through here walking is too slow oh can can i read now ah i can read what this says now yeah. but it's a name rota <laughs> whoa the name made it light up it's the name of one of the valkyries that's quite curious oh so these are valkyries Nice. Uh, uh, it's the Lake of the Nine. Each one has these torches. So, like, are there nine Valkyries in the game that we have to free? The one we fought was, I guess, called Gunnar, and this one was called Rota. So, they're different. Okay. We'll search for those Valkyries later on. I'm gonna tell Sindri I'm a god. I'd like to see the look on his face. No. I may have kept your secret too long. But now you will keep our secret. Huh. I'm ah, just checking if it does anything. Nope. Then let's go. I told you. We should come back with the cipher. I thought you could read this one as well. Oh. What's up? We found something. Why should we hide where we are? Secrets are Odin's way. Shouldn't we be open? Like Tyr? Tyr kept secrets too, for good reasons. To protect people. It is wiser to be discreet. That doesn't mean you should lie to your friends. Or your family. I'm sure Sindri would understand and do the same, lad. Don't fret. <laughs> so what? Excited to finally see the land of the giants? Yeah. But also sad the journey's almost over. Oh, what if we get to Jotunheim and there aren't any giants there either? Makes little difference to us. Fulfilling your mother's wish is what is important. Ah! Oh, don't go anywhere. Be with you in two shakes. Father, can I tell him? No. Tell me what? Did you put this wheel in your mouth? Oh, God. I I'll vomit. I I'm not kidding. I'll throw up on it. It is nothing. A family matter. Oh. Uh, uh, oh, I can tell you a thing or two about family matters. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Let me guess. Your brother isn't as talented as you, and his work is junk. Um, those things are accurate. Your point? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Do something about it or shut up already. I see. Yeah! We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems! Um... Alright. That hurt a little. Let's have a look at your gear then.
can't guarantee you'll like my work today. Expensive tools and stuff can help. Okay, which way up?
broken again. You know, I'm starting to question Sindri's skill. Maybe Brock was right all along. Why did you speak to the dwarf like that? Aren't you sick of hearing about him and his brother? Of course. But it serves nothing to make an enemy of him. He should know the truth, even if it hurts. It was needless and unkind. The truth is more important than kindness. Your mother would disagree. She wasn't a god. can handle it can you after the way you spoke of her i question that what that she wasn't a god she was better than a god and you shall not dishonor her fine carry her yourself follow us to Jotunheim before we get there or whatever. Isn't it a lot simpler if they want us dead because we're gods? And they think we're a threat? I suppose we can't rule it out. But Odin's ways are subtle and his purposes oh. are... Enough about Odin and his whole stupid family. doing too. Nice try. Mother always said all gods were evil. But we're not. Tyr wasn't. Freya neither. But the Acer gods, that's who's evil. And you know what? Odin's right. We are a threat. Because we know what they are and we know we can beat them. Well, not all of them. Not yet. Magni did his worst. And he's dead. They're no better than us. And they're gonna be sorry they picked this fight.
Thor, blame me. Me, for what you did to Magni. My old father called me a coward. Looks like he did more than that. Move it, or we'll pick up where he left off. I'll kill you. <laughs> No. He is beaten. Not worth killing. He should pay for what he said about Mother. I said no. But we're gods. We can do whatever we want. <laughs> That's what I said to your mother, right before I gave it to her. What are you doing? This is a much better knife than mother's. You killed against my wishes. You lost control. Haven't you been teaching me to kill? I have been teaching you to survive. We are God's boy. And that makes us a target. From now until the end of days, you are marked. So I teach you to kill, yes. But in defense of yourself. Never as an indulgence. Nobody cared about him anyways. What's the difference? There are consequences to killing a god! Why? How do you know? How do you know? Watch your tone, boy. Whatever. Man, this kid is becoming an asshole by the day. He's going to become the exact same thing that Kratos hated. That's not good. Really not good. Whatever. What the hell are Oh yeah, 
this room. But we need a new way up. Whatever. Are you talking to me? I thought you didn't like my tongue. Did he just become a teenager in like a fraction of a second? Okay, what's this? Oh yeah, the treasures that we didn't explode you. Lighting up the room. Oh, there's the door, there's the door, there's the door. I can open that up with chisel. We can jump here as well. What's this? It's a hidden chamber. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna stop this episode right here. I'm gonna pause it here for now and we'll fight the Valkyrie in the next one. So we can continue our journey ahead. Well, thank you so much for watching and see you guys again next time.